Welcome to another fascinating journey. This time, our compass points to some of the most breathtaking islands you've probably never heard of. We're about to reveal the top 10 hidden gems scattered across our vast and beautiful planet, each one a paradise in its own right. From the Caribbean's azure waters to the icy beauty of Norway, these islands promise an experience that is as unique as it is unforgettable. So brace yourself as we are about to embark on an unforgettable journey across the globe. If you like this video, please give us a thumbs up, subscribe, and hit the notification bell. Thank you. Starting our countdown at number 10, we have the idyllic Saba in the Caribbean. This island, nestled in the azure waters of the Caribbean Sea, is a hidden gem waiting to be discovered. Unlike its bustling Caribbean siblings, Saba is an oasis of tranquility, renowned for its untouched landscapes and a unique charm that is quintessentially Caribbean. With its highest point reaching nearly 3,000 feet, Saba's skyline is dominated by Mount Scenery, an active volcano that promises breathtaking hiking trails and panoramic views of the island. But Saba is not just about rugged mountains and lush rainforests. The island's coastline, with its pristine beaches and crystal clear waters, is a paradise for snorkelers and divers. And let's not forget about Saba's underwater realm. It's a diver's dream. Teeming with vibrant coral reefs, colorful marine life, and even sunken shipwrecks waiting to be explored. It's no wonder that Saba is often referred to as the unspoiled queen of the Caribbean. But what truly sets Saba apart is its warm and welcoming community. With a population of just over 1,500, the island exudes a small town charm that's hard to resist. The locals are proud of their island's natural beauty and are committed to preserving it for future generations. Saba, a tiny jewel in the Caribbean that promises to steal your heart. An island that's so off the beaten path, it's practically a secret, but now the secret is out. At number nine, we cross the Atlantic to the windswept Îles de la Madeleine in Canada. This archipelago is not just a cluster of islands. It's a magical realm that seems to have been carved by the hands of a whimsical artist. The islands are wrapped in a ribbon of golden sandstone cliffs that glow under the sun. Their curves and contours shaped by the relentless dance of wind and waves over countless years. But these islands are more than just a spectacular geological spectacle. They are the heartland of an incredible Acadian culture, a vibrant tapestry woven from threads of history, music, and a joie de vivre that is infectious. Here, the lilting strains of a fiddle can lead you to a foot-stomping kitchen party where stories are shared and friendships are forged over hearty meals and the warm glow of hospitality. The Ile de la Madeleine are a place where nature meets culture in a dazzling display of beauty and diversity. You can feel the pulse of the island in its lively music festivals, taste it in the tang of the sea on your lips as you bite into a freshly caught lobster, and see it in the colorful houses that dot the landscape, like confetti. So, if you're ever in search of an island experience that goes beyond the ordinary, remember the Îles de la Madeleine. Here, the wind, waves, and culture weave a unique tapestry, creating an enchanting island melody that will echo in your heart long after you've left its shores. Our next stop at number eight is the Polynesian paradise of Tuvalu. Picture an island nation that's a hidden gem nestled in the heart of the Pacific Ocean. Tuvalu, with its nine small islands, is a dream come true for beach lovers. Its stunning beaches adorned with swaying palm trees and surrounded by crystal clear turquoise waters are a sight to behold. The isolation of these islands offers an undisturbed oasis, perfect for those seeking tranquility away from the hustle and bustle of everyday life. But there's more to Tuvalu than just its picturesque landscapes. Its traditional Polynesian culture is deeply rooted in the island's way of life. The rhythm of Tuvaluan music, the vibrancy of their dances, and the warmth of the locals is certain to charm you. Their handcrafted artifacts made with love and precision tell tales of their rich heritage and traditional folklore. Yet, this paradise is under an undeniable threat. Tuvalu is one of the most vulnerable nations to climate change. Rising sea levels and increasing storm surges pose a serious risk to this low-lying island nation. But the people of Tuvalu are resilient. They're fighting to preserve their home and their culture, making every effort to adapt and combat the impacts of climate change. Visiting Tuvalu is not just about enjoying its pristine beaches and immersive culture, it's also about understanding and appreciating the delicate balance between nature and human life. Tuvalu, a paradise under threat, waiting for you to uncover its beauty. At number seven, we veer off the beaten track to Khan Dao in Vietnam. A place of profound tranquility and raw beauty, Khan Dao is an archipelago that sits off the southeast coast of Vietnam. This group of 16 islands and islets, carpeted in thick verdant forest and ringed by coral reefs, 
is a haven for wildlife and nature lovers alike. One of the most striking features of Kondao is its pristine beaches. The island's coastlines are largely untouched, a rarity in this day and age. Imagine sinking your toes into the soft white sand as you take in the magnificent view of the turquoise sea. It's a beach lover's paradise. But Kondao isn't just about natural allure, it also has a rich history that adds depth to its charm. Once a prison island during the French colonial era, its past is etched into the landscape. The remnants of old prisons and colonial buildings provide a stark contrast to the island's idyllic setting, adding a layer of intrigue to your visit. The island's diverse wildlife is another draw. From rare black giant squirrels to the endangered green and hawksbill turtles, Kondao is a critical sanctuary for a host of unique species. The surrounding waters are also teeming with marine life, making it a prime spot for snorkeling and diving. So there you have it. Kondao, where history and nature intertwine in breathtaking harmony. Halfway through our list at number six, we find ourselves in Niue, a hidden gem in the South Pacific. This island is a paradise for those who crave a connection with nature, far from the matting crowds of conventional tourist spots. Niue is a haven for water enthusiasts who are drawn to its crystal clear waters. Imagine diving into an undersea wonderland, where visibility can reach up to a staggering hundred feet. You'll find yourself swimming alongside a dazzling array of marine life, from colorful tropical fish to gentle sea turtles. But Niue's charms aren't confined to its waters. The island is also home to remarkable limestone formations that are a sight to behold. These natural sculptures carved by wind and water over countless millennia provide a stark and beautiful contrast to the island's lush greenery. Exploring these formations, you'll feel as though you've stepped into a different world, one where nature reigns supreme. And let's not forget the people of Niue, with a population of just over a thousand. It's a close-knit community where everyone knows everyone. But don't let its size fool you. The locals are renowned for their warmth and friendliness, ready to welcome visitors with open arms and share stories of their island home. So if you're seeking a truly unique travel experience, Niue is the place to be. With its pristine waters, stunning landscapes, and welcoming locals, it offers a taste of paradise that's hard to find elsewhere. Niue, an unspoiled treasure waiting to be discovered. Moving on to number five, we head to the tropical paradise of Fernando de Noronha in Brazil. Off the northeastern coast of Brazil, Fernando de Noronha is a dreamy archipelago of 21 islands and islets. This UNESCO World Heritage Site is a stunning spectacle of dramatic landscapes where volcanic peaks rise majestically from the azure waters of the Atlantic and verdant forests cloak their rugged flanks. But the beauty of Fernando de Noronha doesn't stop at the shoreline. The island's rich biodiversity extends into the surrounding waters where vibrant coral reefs teem with an extraordinary array of marine life. Schools of colorful fish dart among the corals, while graceful sea turtles glide serenely through the crystal clear waters. Dolphins frolic in the waves, and if you're fortunate, you might even glimpse a shark or two. Yet it's not just the natural beauty that sets Fernando de Noronha apart. The island operates an exclusive tourism policy to protect its delicate ecosystems. Only a limited number of visitors are permitted on the island each day, ensuring that you can enjoy the island's beauty without the crowds. And with no large-scale developments, the island retains a wonderfully unspoiled charm. Whether you're exploring the island's lush rainforests, snorkeling in its shimmering waters, or simply lazing on its pristine beaches, Fernando de Norona offers an unforgettable experience. An island where the rhythm of life is dictated by the ebb and flow of the tides and the rising and setting of the sun. Fernando de Norona, a paradise where nature reigns supreme. At number four, we voyage to the enchanting islands of Sao Tome and Principe off the African coast. These charming specks of land, cradled by the warm waters of the Gulf of Guinea, are a paradise waiting to be discovered. Imagine journeying through lush rainforests that echo with the calls of exotic birds, where every step reveals new wonders. The islands are home to a rich diversity of flora and fauna, many of which are found nowhere else in the world. This includes the rare dwarf olive ibis, the giant begonia, and the Sao Tome growbeak, a delicate bird species that is a joy to behold. But the magic of Sao Tome and Principe isn't confined to its rainforests. Venture into the heart of the islands, and you'll find yourself immersed in a rich coffee culture that dates back centuries. The fertile volcanic soil here produces some of the world's finest Arabica and Robusta beans. The sweet aroma of freshly brewed coffee is a constant companion as you explore the bustling local markets and quaint colonial towns. From the verdant peaks of Pico Cal Grande to the golden beaches of Praia Jele, Sao Tome and Principe is a symphony of natural beauty. 
It's a place where time seems to stand still and where every moment is a celebration of nature's bounty. Sautome and Principe, where nature, culture, and coffee blend into an unforgettable experience. Taking the third spot, we journey to the icy wilderness of Svalbard in Norway. This isn't just an island, it's a whole archipelago sitting at the very edge of the Arctic Circle. The landscape is a mesmerizing tableau of icy fjords and towering glaciers. But don't be fooled by the island's frosty demeanor, Svalbard is teeming with life. In the summer months, the tundra comes alive with a flourish of Arctic flowers, creating a colorful contrast against the stark white backdrop. Wildlife enthusiasts will be thrilled to spot polar bears, Arctic foxes, and reindeer roaming the wilderness. The surrounding seas are a playground for seals and whales, while the skies are ruled by a myriad of bird species. Svalbard is not just about the day, though. As the sun sets, the sky transforms into a celestial theater. The northern lights, or aurora borealis, dance across the sky in a symphony of greens, pinks, and purples. The spectacle is, simply put, otherworldly. This isn't a place for the faint-hearted. It's a land of extremes, where the sun never sets in summer and never rises in winter. It's a place where the wilderness still reigns supreme and where every vista is a postcard from the end of the world. But for those who dare, Svalbard offers an adventure like no other. It's an island that's as wild as it is beautiful, as challenging as it is rewarding. Svalbard, a frozen wonderland where nature's magic is on full display. Just missing the top spot at number two, we land on the serene shores of Lord Howe Island in Australia. Picture an idyllic paradise where the mountains meet the sea and where the air is filled with the songs of rare birds. That's Lord Howe Island for you. Nestled in the Tasman Sea, this crescent-shaped wonder is a spectacle of nature's grandeur. The island's landscape is a vibrant tapestry of lush rainforests, rugged mountains, and pristine beaches. The awe-inspiring Mount Gower stands tall, its peak often shrouded in mist, adding a dash of mystery to the island's charm. The clear waters of the lagoon, teeming with colorful coral reefs, invite you to take a plunge into an underwater world teeming with life. Lord Howe Island is a haven for biodiversity. From the flightless wooden to the majestic Kentia palm, the island is home to a host of unique species that are found nowhere else on Earth. It's a living museum of natural history, a testament to the evolutionary wonders that isolation can breed. But the real beauty of Lord Howe Island lies in its tranquility. The island limits its visitors to just 400 at a time, preserving the serenity that makes this place so special. Here, you can escape the hustle and bustle of the world and find a peaceful retreat amidst nature's splendor. Lord Howe Island, a sanctuary of peace and biodiversity. Finally, at number one, we find ourselves at the mystical Isle of Skye in Scotland. Renowned for its rugged landscapes, quaint villages, and formidable medieval castles, the Isle of Skye is a location where history and the natural world blend together in awe-inspiring unity. You won't find any bustling airports or crowded cruise ports here. Instead, the Isle of Skye can be accessed by a mesmerizing drive through the Scottish Highlands. This seclusion has given rise to a unique community. A population of just over 10,000 people make this island their home, and they've maintained a society that embodies the essence of unity and resilience. Living in a place that seems frozen in time, the locals have learned to balance modernity with tradition, relying heavily on tourism and farming. But it's not just the community that makes the Isle of Skye special. The island's stunning landscapes, sculpted by ancient geological activity, are a spectacle to behold. Imagine steep mountains, rolling green valleys, and the imposing presence of the ancient Dunvegan Castle, all surrounded by the endless blue of the Atlantic. The island is a haven for those who seek solitude and a close connection to nature. And so, if you're ever in the mood for an adventure that's truly out of the ordinary, consider the Isle of Skye. It may be remote, but it's a place that offers a unique perspective on life and a chance to experience a world that remains blissfully untouched by the rush of modern society. The Isle of Skye, the ultimate off-the-beaten-path destination. And there we have it, folks. Ten breathtaking islands that you've probably never heard of, but definitely deserve a spot on your travel bucket list. From the Caribbean's hidden jewel Saba to the mystical Isle of Skye in Scotland, each offering unique landscapes, diverse wildlife, and rich cultures. Until our next adventure, keep exploring, keep discovering, and remember, the world is full of hidden gems waiting to be discovered. Mm.